Hi guys, it's Lisa with the Born Yard Chicken. I have a Dollar Tree haul, and uh, if you would please help support my channel by commenting below and subscribing. Anyway, first of all, I have these really cool Hampton Arts stamps. I didn't get the whole collection, but these are the ones I found at my store. And um, this one here has these stamps. And then these little tiny flowers. And um, there's seven pieces in this one. Here is your uh, product code. And then this is the next one. It's got a whole bunch of little butterflies, leaves, flowers. And this one is 15 pieces. And I did see these on DollarTree.com, so you could possibly order of them. But I believe you got to order a case. And um, this one is so cute. Look at those birds. And that bird is super cute. And it has a bunch of little, with much love for you. There is 15 pieces in this one as well. And then this one, oh, I just love that iris. Reminded, reminds me of a triple bearded iris. And for some reason, I can't talk today. But they are so pretty. This one only has seven pieces. This one has 20 pieces. And, um... But there's a lot of small little pieces. And the last one, I just love those trees. There's 11 pieces in this set. That is pretty. Okay. And uh, that's those. And these are duplicates of the ones that I showed you already. And um, I decided to pick one of these up. I've been passing them by. They have a cupcake and some other ones. I've seen all of them, but I really wasn't interested in them. But I think this might actually make a cute stamp. And um, then I found these little roller, self-inking roller stamps. And this one has the little hearts. They had all different kind. I got a couple of them. I didn't get them all. That's your product code. And... Um, I picked up another one of these. There are 50 sales order slips in here with um, um, receipts. I mean, you know, duplicates, carbon copies, or whatever you want. Anyway, it was a dollar. I'm going to use that in my junk journal. And then I found these. This is the first time I've ever seen these. I've, anyway, this one is Happy Birthday. And... Um, I can't see. I don't see on there where it says how many's in there. But there's quite a few. They're small. Here is your product code. Anyway. They had this they had these and then they had another one with two little ink squares in it. And then they had an, another one that was a block. So um yeah. I just love those and then they had these these are the little uh, blocks you put your stamps on then you ink them up and stamp it on your product anyway for a dollar these things are so expensive like between six and twelve dollars depending on what size and brand you get and um, so I was excited to get these I never can find mine every time I get ready to do something I have to buy another one and I've never even actually used them and oh here's another set this one is little cactuses stuck on you love something grows anyway so I thought those were cute and I got all the blocks that I could find 
and uh, but I only got um, a few of the other I didn't like I said I didn't get all of the stamp sets and then I got this one this one has uh, flowers and butterflies on it it's another one of the self inking rotary stamps and I also got some stickers these are heart stickers there's 15 heart stickers in here here is your product code for that and um, they had all different kind of these but I just didn't really I wasn't in the mood so I just got what I was in the mood for it and these are love and there are different ones of these I thought these were adorable and um, I don't know if the product codes the same or not there you go and this one's I love you so I, I believe I got two of each one of them I got two of these two of these and two of these so and then here's the other set happy Valentine's Day isn't that little sock monkey just adorable so anyway I'm moving right along I got this book cemetery girl anyway the reason I got the book was because look at the pictures other than them being shiny these are really cool pictures I mean good color and I just really like it. I'm not I'm not going to tell you I'm 100% happy about Cemetery Girl. But, I mean, I don't know nothing about her. Nothing bad about her. But, you know, um, I love the pictures and the graphics. So I'm going to be using the pictures in my scrapbook. I, I mean, in my junk journals. And then when I'm done, this is a hardback book. And I can use this to make another journal. And I actually got all of these. Or I got several of them. I didn't get them all. Looks like I got four. I got four of Cemetery Girl. And I was trying to be good. And I really uh, could have gotten more. But I decided that I would wait until I did something with these. And if they had them, I would get them. And if they didn't, I didn't need them. So anyway, I also got these books. The Onion Magazine. The iconic covers that transformed an <laughs> under-deserving world. So anyway, these are magazine covers. And um, so I thought they would be cool to use in my journaling. And um, so yeah, this book was regularly $26 in the U.S., 29 in Canada. It's a hardback book. I can use the book when I'm done using the pages. And uh, at the very least, I got two of them. <laughs> I think I got more, but yeah. And uh, then I also got this book, Cheap Eats. I just thought it was really cute, Cheap Eats. And... Uh, I like the pages. I like everything about it. So I'm going to go through it and see if there's anything here uh, I could use. Like if I like some of the recipes or whatever, I might just keep it as a cookbook. And if not, I'm going to use it in my journals as well. Then I um, also, oh here I found another one of these. That's a duplicate. I believe I got two of each one unless, uh, unless they didn't have it available. And then I found these stickers. These are just adorable stickers. I already have something in mind for them. Anyway, uh, they're just really pretty. And uh, here's another one. It's similar. There's nine in here. There was nine in the other one. Um, oh, here's another one. Those blocks. Um, oh, yeah. There's two more of those. They had quite a few of those. So, I picked up a few of them. I didn't pick up all of them. But I did pick up a lot of them. Here is four more of that one. 
and then I think this is the first one I showed you and then this is another one so they're just really pretty and vintagey looking and um, that's that one. Oh, and this is a different one. I just love this particular one here. Oh, and the, the bird. I like this bird, too. There's two of these. And uh, they had all different kind of stamps. Some really nice ones. I just couldn't figure what I was going to do with them. That's just duplicates. And, uh, oh, yeah. Here's those other ones. I already showed you that one. Oh, here's one I didn't show you. This one is 12 pieces, and uh, have you seen that one? Yeah, and you've seen that one. That one's curled. I don't know how that happened. So, uh, I might be to the end. Let's see. Okay, so I did get some more books, and I got this book. And the only reason I got this book is because I loved the wide spine. I thought that would make a great journal. So, and then I got this book here. I thought this would be good for a journal. It's a nice thick spine. And I realize you could make the spines bigger, but... Oh, and this is the only one of these I found... It's another one of those really cool comic type books. This one's just black and white, but I just love this style of comic book. For some reason, I've never been into comic books before, and so it reminds me of Speed Racer. <laughs> um, that's probably aging myself. So, yeah. I'm excited about that. I'm going to use that in my journals. And then, um, I may just keep this book. It's another cookbook. But, uh, if I don't keep it, I'll use it in my journals. But, it seemed fun. So, I thought, I thought I'd get it. And, then I got two more of those magazine cover books. And I think that's it. I think that's it for this Dollar Tree haul. This is Lisa with the Barnyard Chicken sending all my love and my hugs. If you could please comment below, like, and subscribe. Thank you very much.